It's practice time in Jody Hill's Hobart studio. But keeping budding concert pianists sounding great requires the right tradesperson. It's a little bit comparable with Formula One racing that there we, we need um, top line mechanics who can work in that specialised area, as well as those sort of mechanics who can do everyday cars very well. Um, we're at the situation in certainly in southern Tasmania where there's a lack in both areas. There's just one person in southern Tasmania with the specialised skills to maintain concert pianos and he's planning retirement. It would be tragic for some of these instruments not to be maintained, to, to deteriorate. Ms Heald shared her concerns with the Tasmanian Symphony Orchestra and together they've come up with a solution. The TSO is offering a new scholarship to train two piano tuners to work in Tasmania. Over the last 30 years, all of the courses where you would go to learn how to tune pianos, voice and regulate pianos have gradually wound down. The scholarship recipients will have to train in Sydney. It's estimated Southern Tasmania needs at least six piano tuners. It currently has only two or three. What we really need is that pipeline of people coming through into the profession that can look after instruments that have often been in families for generations, uh, all the instruments of schools, our university, and then of course the great concert instruments of Tasmania like the ones here at the TSO. It seemed to attract a lot of um, very, very interesting artists and actors and people to live here. We haven't been able to get a new piano tuner. <laughs> Hoping this pitch resonates with a new generation. Georgie Burgess, ABC News.